Let's get started immediately. <sighs> I can't believe we actually reached this incentive, but here we are. <laughs> oh god. Make your selection now. Well, I'm not gonna do that I did the first time and uh, showcase what happens with uh, if two players have uh, equal scores. Yeah. Uh, Basically nothing happens, it's just game overs anyways, so no point. There is no secret ninth level. Safe states will be used, rewinds will be used, because some of these are really ridiculous. So let's go with Star Evil. <laughs> I love gold! <laughs> Make your second now. A reminder that this was originally my very first stream like ever. And yep, we're shooting Q-tips. Q-tips are killing a birthday cake. If I remember right, I want to try to hug the right side as much as I can. It's easier that way, except the controls are so sensitive that sometimes it doesn't work. Good hitbox, once again. <laughs> Don't let the birthday cake die from touching you, because the game will softlock. Not even joking about that. Because these games are... I've been programmed in like three months after all, so they are not very well made. As no QA was done, because they didn't have time. And when you get to stage four, the game dies! And the jumping controls, as with any platformers for Action 52, are complete garbage. But you knew that already! Guess that's why we're here now. You bring a light? No. Alright, I'll actually deny this death. Yeah, sure. Yeah, if you fall down a gap of two centimeter, you just die. Because action 52. People just, I like it's like the free enemies that just spaz out like crazy. Yep. They don't know what to do, so spaz. Batteries kill you. No. Ah! Stupid bats. No! <laughs> um, yeah, the level's now impossible. Good job, Action 52. <laughs> Good lord. Alright, level 10! And there's bats again. No. So it's time for G Force Fighter. Complete. Oh, hey, it's G Force Faggot. <laughs> I didn't Fight. dare to say it, but yep, we're playing G Force Fighter. No, that's not what it was said. <laughs> <laughs> the game where you can just stay at the no, top and not nothing happens to you. Well, that was G Force Fighter, everyone. Yep. It's time for Ooze. Ooze. And we have eight lives in this version. And the First jump thing. is still garbage. Oh, oh, this is. This not jump good. is kind of bad. Yeah. <sighs> Jumps are awful. Alright, level two. Yeah. That doesn't look like ooze, that looks like blood. This is also if you're playing the A revision of this game, the last level, because then it crashes. But we have revision B, so we can continue. Can you stop going through the I think fucking I'm already thing? like 25% oh. done with the game already. Oh, okay. Is, yeah, yeah. Isn't that bullets just pat fly past him? Like, what the hell is up with that? How many levels are in this? Six. Isn't it? Oh. Uh, six. So we're almost done then. Because the manual says after you beat level five, but the manual the manual is a fucking liar. <laughs> oh Jesus. These freaking jumping ass jelly beans just killing you quickly. Hey, level six. There you go. This level is complete garbage. 
Yeah, I'm remember to, how much remember the controls suck in this game? Yeah, now you have to do actual platforming with those. Good fucking luck. Yeah, we can't. We just gotta try to stay up above high ground, not touch the top as well. This is sick. This is like the same level, but just a loop right now. Yes! Welcome to Action 52! Right, oh, I thought it was funny. Uh. There we go! <sighs> we beat yeah. Ooze! Good god. Ah, oh boy. Alright, Silver Sword. Eight bucks, of garbage. The garbage! Such a fucking garbage, oh my god. <laughs> He's singing. Oh my god. Eh. Can you not? Stupid sperm thingy. God, silver sword. Sword isn't even silver. And that did not hit me. That was completely unnecessary. With a million dead ends. <laughs> eh. Eh. Oh, I'm clipping through the thing. Okay, good. Okay. <laughs> okay. Can we not? Can we not? Okay. So these pointers and more music. Okay, level oh, no, one. No. We're done. <laughs> hey, this is the game. We play as a Metroid, and we're trying to avoid Tetris blocks. Basically, you don't even need to destroy anything. <laughs> Critical British Petroleum. <laughs> yeah, just stay to the edge of the screen and try to avoid the meteors, and that's how you win the game. That's really all you have to do. <laughs> Right, <laughs> this level end. All right, the end. All right, level one, we're done. Thank you. Because this game has like seven or eight levels, which uh, basically means destroy oh. a lot of these things. Oh, All right, level two. <laughs> Nothing changes other than the background a bit. Yeah. Like there's an there's like a supernova in the top left, and that's really the only interesting thing. And yeah, nothing happens if these things touch the ground, by the way. Yeah, there are seven levels, yeah. I just got the I just got the guide up here. Why do you have a guide open for this? Wheels? <laughs> How does this go again? STOP GARDING ME WHEELS! This'll be better than listening to this garbage again. Okay, level 7. Final level. Nothing has changed. Oh, thank Jesus freaking Christ. We're done. Okay. <laughs> it's time for funny. Alfred and the Fedek. Who is not crashing? <laughs> nice. That's a great fucking start. Do you die from a from a big height or something? I don't know. Of course you do. <laughs> it's this action fifty two we're talking about. This game, though. Proof of concept. Also, the the music's going out of sync. By the way, it's kind of weird. Level two. Now we're on Doctor Mario pills. And uh, we have a ravioli that looks like a condom wrapper. Because, sure. <laughs> it's not even touching me. Okay, I guess I can just do that and not die from fall damage. 
because that's how it works in real life. So Operation Full Moon, it's time. It's time for more eye searing garbage. And yeah, this game has two types of enemies. Enemies that shoot, turrets that shoot left and turrets that shoot right. None of them are trending whatsoever. If you get shot by these turrets, you can take one damage from your non-existent life bar, but if you hit a wall, you instantly explode. Cause that's how it works. As much hard as uh, Bayou Billy is, it's... N it's not as garbage as this. And Star Evil Block, you gotta move left. Apparently I was too close, can't have that. This thing, other than some shitty placement of walls, there's no challenge. Proof of concept on shitty placement of walls. Another Star Evil Block, and now we're in shit territory. Literal shit the game, literal shit the game. Droning music, it's fucking boring, oh my god I can't... Uh... <laughs> Level 6, and we're in purple land. As you know, the moon's totally purple, right? Level 7, it's still going, spawn inside a block, because of course. Now in, we're in searing pink. Because that's the color you think of when you think of the moon, right? Why are there so many levels to this game? Oh, well, I know. we beat the game, the game crashed. <laughs> I'm to restart. If you shoot up and down, the bullets follow it and Man, scroll you with you, so... And there is a place where if you go there, you actually softlock yourself. Why is this called Damn Busters? I've got no idea. Also up here is, if you go there, you're trapped, so don't go there. And that's it, that's them, Busters. <laughs> There's two levels. <laughs> this is the game where if you go to the right of the screen, you die. If you go to the left of the screen, you don't die. And if you keep firing like a madman, nothing spawns. Oh, I'll have to uh, dodge a hunched up eggplant, because... They decided to be on the left side this time. Oh my god. They actually shoot diagonal. And level 3. This level is not available in revision A of Action 52. Because of course it isn't. And the freaking screen is glitching up. So shocker of all shock. Why is there a level 4? I didn't remember this having 4 levels. Now it's time for Haunted Hill or Haunted Hall because they can't decide what the actual title is. Hello Skull. One of the rare time where the jumping is not actually too bad. Are we approaching the boss because yes, this game has bosses. We haven't seen bosses ever since freaking uh, Star Evil. be a breed of fresh air, I suppose. And I think it's supposed to be a spider, but you can't really tell. And level 2, where we have slightly different music. Also, don't jump this, or else you hit the chain and die. But not only that, but if you jump down here, you hit the air and you die. What the hell? Apparently I went through the platform and into the vats of goo, or whatever it's supposed to be. Oh, right, I'm sorry. I forgot, I hit the air and I die. Yes. Well, that's the end of the level, just touch this block and there we go. Done with hunted dolls. <laughs> uh, 
and you turn into a snowball if you fall down. Because of course you hit the air and die once again. Level 3. Okay, that's cheap game. What? <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll just have to tank a hit. Now we're fighting snowballs with snowballs, which I believe is the same remark I made the first time we went here. Well, this is fair. This is fair and totally doable. Let's go! Nope. Hit the air and you die. Do I want to do sharks now? Yeah. I'm gonna have to do it eventually. So yeah, most important, most interesting part of this game is that you can shoot laser beam out of your your butt. Because of course. Come on. The hitbox on these sharks, though, is complete garbage. Yeah. Just trying to get my crutch laser back. Okay, level 3. This is where the jellyfish start, and it's complete garbage. <laughs> I love when they spawn for like, 3 frames. Like, you, sure, I'm gonna have time to shoot them. Yep, holy. <sighs> really? Why? 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 No, I'm genuinely asking why. I'm clearly hitting the guy. Level 5, okay. I'm, gonna, no, I'm not gonna subject you to this music. Because level 5 is gonna take a while, so... Let's lower the, the quote-unquote music from the game. And put my own for now. Come on. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, we're in, I think, the last level. Let me briefly see that again. God, the hit detection! Okay, we're done with sharks then. Screw you sharks, let's go with Megalonia instead, which... I remember being a very annoying space shooter because the music is disgusting. And we're fighting whatever this is. I think someone called it a dresser at some point. But I don't actually know what it is. It could be anything. And this boss is cheating by being on my side of the area. I think you can't go in this thing, too. Yeah, you can't. So your area of uh, damaging this guy is very limited. Just 
level's actually easier because you're not limited. And graphical garbage. Fantastic. We're suffering more graphical garbage again. And the boss didn't spawn. Thanks for the tip. L L L O O O O O O O O O O V E. The enemy spawn wherever they want, and that includes over you. And gotta love your sprite going ape shit when you're doing that on the ladders. And of course, if you uh, try to go down too quickly, you'll disintegrate because, you know. When you're going left and right, your sprite does actually change a little bit. It's very slight and doesn't make much of a difference. Because we still have garbage it detection, so... Yep. I don't know what this has to do with the Atmos or Quake, but, you know... At least the mu the the level length is consistent with the music, so you pretty much know when it's gonna end. There's a few of these games that have that. Truster had that earlier, too. <laughs> Once again, good hit detection. Level 5. <laughs> I don't know if this is possible, but I'm actually gonna try. Yeah, I think this is our kill screen, everyone. Unless someone actually has a, uh, a code to make you invulnerable. So that's level 5 with most quake. I don't know if there is a level 6. Let me get the recording started. Seven minutes in heaven with Tifa. That will be my final fantasy. And that was a good moment to start the recording. Hello everyone, welcome back to Action 52. <laughs> yes! 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 And the image is not getting picked up, of course. A reminder about Myung. If you don't do anything, you just die. Basically, this is trial and error the game. So much different. The thing is, you can't just stay in place, because as showcase at the start, you blow up! So, yeah. <laughs> there was nothing there. I love how the traps don't show up until you die in them. And gotta appreciate this beautiful music, by the way. Excellent soundtrack. What music? <laughs> exactly! Hey, level 3! How many people have seen this far into this game? Oh hey, there's actual bombs! Now it makes sense! Every single stage in all the game are different games. Because, you know, that's how game programming works. Should have put pirated games. 52 pirated games that we all know and love. Miong sounds like a Chinese way of... Uh... Of a cat saying meow, meow. <laughs> now it's Space Dream, which I think I remember having oh, way too many levels. Oh, pacifier. You're a pacifier shooting at objects, and you have one of the best death noises. <laughs> Just waiting for the music to finish its main loop will finish the level. Level 9, it's still going. Hey, we have new enemies. We have cars. <laughs> These the falling cars. <laughs> beep beep. <laughs> Level 11. <laughs> I just noticed we have rocking horses now. I don't think we had those before. <laughs> For a falling horseman. Final level. We have oh, ducks now! I forgot! 
And when you're unpausing, you can't use other keys or it pauses again because this game is so well programmed. All right, and it's time for probably the better game in the compilation. Oh, it's this, Dreamers. I, lo I, I love this game. It's Bionic Commando with balloons. Oh, yeah, Unavoidable yeah. damage. And level two. Electrical land. I don't know, for some reason, I just imagine Luigi just humming that while playing this. 70s porn music, Cheetah Man. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there we go. God, that's such a tight climb. You just beat up things and they go, oh. Also, also, you lunge backwards to punch. <laughs> because that's how it works in real life, right? This is very precise. All right. Ah, my God. And one little mistake will send you back. Yar, space lobster. <laughs> well, uh, be prepared for about thirty minutes of this shit because uh, there's nineteen fucking levels of this. That thing looks like an ice cube tray. Come on! Oh, hit something for the love of fuck! Come on, how are you supposed to deal with this? I wish I could do diagonal lines! <laughs> Level diagonal 15! Diagonal lines. Ah! <laughs> this is such garbage! <laughs> this is the one of the worst games in the fucking compilation, right there. Mostly because of all the shit you have to go through to actually get to level 19. What the fuck are you supposed to do about this? Crawling. Level 18! It's so fucking fast! It's so fucking fast and you're way too fucking slow! Final level! I'm already fucking dead. Why did they think sending a space lobster would be a good idea to get through this menace of ice? Yes! Yes, thank <laughs> god! Oh, the fat lady is saying, yes. Thank you, Aizen, for the bits. Oh, by the way, the spikes, eh, they just decoration. Unless there's multiple in a row. Then they actually hurt you. There's a weird story about this game. After seeing the interview with the uh, music designer, apparently this character was based on his girlfriend, apparently. Oh, really? And level 2, which is completely different with the Star Evil block at the start. Because why not? Oh my god, it's 4-3 uh, of Super Mario Brothers. Oh, mushrooms. Yep. <laughs> and we looped. So that's All Bubblegum right. Rosie, but uh, let's, uh, let's just see if this is true. Oh no, dude. It's not... Yep, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> Whoa! So yeah, I'm gonna cheat. I'm blatantly admitting it. I'm putting it at fifty percent speed. <laughs> and even then, it's not this. gonna be helping very much. What the fuck just killed me? The fucking walls didn't load in properly because there's too much shit on these screens. Okay. You can actually resume at regular speed now. Except... Oh, damn. Oh my god, I hit him once. Oh, come on! Good luck with that one, that dog keeps freaking deciding to... 
give you some help. What is this? Why are you not moving, Micro Mike? Oh, because my fucking controller went offline for no fucking reason. Thanks, oh, asshole. Can you Come reconnect? Please, what the please. hell? What's the battery level of your controller? It's still green! Level 2 is not as unfair, surprisingly. It's still pretty unfair and you move got way too god awfully fast. But at least you can do you can sort of gauge your movement. <laughs> Look at it! I'm hiding the fucking thing and it's not actually touching it. Come on, that was right on it! Come on! The hitboxes are the worst fucking thing! The absolute worst! Most definitely. <laughs> yeah! Level 3! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, this is just unfair. The enemy literally spawned on me. Quite literally. Can we just say this is complete? Honestly? No, no, no. I, I, uh, I've got another idea. Just give me a moment. I need to find out actually how many hits I can take. Oh my god, I found the hit points! Alright! Let's give myself a crap ton of hit points. This is the only way I'm gonna win this. Might have to give myself some more hit points soon. Okay, never mind. We're fucking done, thank god. Oh my god. Oh yeah, uh, yeah, you can go through walls, by the way. Level 2. And shortcut! Cause fuck this game. Come on! <laughs> oh, damn it. No, this is Donkey Kong 52. <laughs> <laughs> and there we go. It's another one that I actually completed the first time. Because it's very, very short. Oh my god, why is this lagging? And that's the game. There's two levels. I don't even know how to explain what's happening here. Non-human. Such a cult classic. All of John faces down there. Oh. We're done! <laughs> That's not you, man! One level! One single freaking level! I was a teenager pre pretending to be a baby, and I kind of agree. What? <laughs> <laughs> the sprite's just spazzing out. Same thing for that lady. This is more literal shit the game. Except uh, for the fact that uh, you really don't need to fight anyone. Mm -hmm. Why slash people up? Anyways, you're not slashing, you're just doing this. And this. Oh, <laughs> my
I'm I glad like someone that finally fun. redeemed that for once. All right, level two. So yeah, we have a big-breasted lady. We've got Spotter Man, and we've got freaking Bluto for no reason. And unfortunately, you can't go forward until they despawn. So there's a surprising amount of detail in this freaking subway, considering how shit quality the whole thing is. Oh god. Time for microscopic sprites, everyone! I like the description of this game though. They called this game educational. Like what? Educational puzzle game. Picture matching with many levels, game and options, test memory and concentration skills. <laughs> what? Yeah. I know! <laughs> Let me read slashes for a second. This is, they are everywhere. Mean guys with nails that are nine inch knives, and they like to slash everything that comes into their path. Don't get in their way, or you'll be the next victim. Man, they really put into a lot of thought of these descriptions of these kings. Fuzz power, baby! Right, and I still don't know how to get through the impossible jump, but uh, we'll cross that bridge once we get there. There's nothing else to say. Fuzzy must get to the land of Goguru. He's got oh to avoid God. the walking brush. He's got to avoid the walking brushes, hair dryers, combs, and other natural hair disasters. Because if he loses all of his hair, he's bald, and the game is over. <laughs> the combs are easy to fight off. It's just the blow dryers are not. Yeah, because they shoot hair. There's bombs now. There's Wait, what? What are these bombs? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why do they put bombs? You can, they'll just put about just about anything in this game. <laughs> We're naked again. <laughs> naked man. And the impossible level. Yay. And now I can't attack anymore. Wait. Oh, we're invincible. And Yay. that's the end of the game. <laughs> yep, we're done. Sadly. Time for boring shit once again. Shooting gal. Larry. <laughs> Originally, in the revision A of this uh, travesty, this game crashes when you start select or attempt to finish the first level. But in this version, it should actually work. Yeah. Let's There's see, a fucking gun, like... mott again. Ah, God. Get out, of... Moths. Get out moths of here. You got moths trying to live. Go back to one. Animal Crossing. <laughs> you don't. You don't have your net equipped, dude. <laughs> Level two. Look at what's different. If you said nothing, you are correct. Despite this being a shooting gallery, the thing you're supposed to be shooting can eventually come down to your level and kill you. Because yes, there is actually a way to die in this game. <laughs> level 6! <six. Yeah. laughs> oh my god. I'm making my own music for this game. <laughs> you have a surprising amount of range with that goddamn lollipop, lollipop dude. And a... time for Sa the return of Satan Chan. Game over, return of Satan Chan. <laughs> What the fuck? But yeah, this time I actually have to complete this level in all its glitchy glory. Instead of actually pulling music data, it's trying to pull music data from the graphics or whatever. Ah! 
no. It's so... It's so bad. There's one of the exits for the level. There's actually two exits, so I'm gonna try to showcase the other one. Cause yeah, that does bring you back to level one. But yeah, there's actually a hard limit to the level, and fun fact, if you kill this guy, you're soft-locked. Really? Yep, because the level doesn't end. You have to take one of these three exits. I actually need to go back quite a bit to actually do that. Shit. Meanwhile, we're hearing very strange noises in reverse. Lord. <laughs> just, That's just, even just... worse. There we go. Uh, uh, wait, uh, wait, wait, what? Uh, the glitchy what? music stays? Oh shit. What? Well damn. <laughs> you can never escape it. <laughs> Does that mean the whole game is gonna be like this now? I gotta find out. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's that Extend noise? <laughs> Extend play. No, cause this is too mysterious. I gotta find so, out more. So... Oh, we got a single blurb, really. Uh, <laughs> Oh, wait, if now this level level has been Satanified, how is level three gonna be then? Since it's already Satanified. Yep, even this level. Hmm. This is kind of new game plus right here. <laughs> it's new game plus. <laughs> <laughs> the lollipop new game plus. Play the game with sa uh, Satan music the whole time. All right, let's see. Is it even more Satanified? Ah, uh, I missed the Taco Man song. A wrong game. God damn. Please no. Please no. Anyways, that's enough of Satanic pop. Ah, the spirit of Manchester. And that probably will be my ne my newest uh, text tone. It's just the <laughs> Manchester <laughs> cell. <laughs> it's like, oh, I got a text message. <laughs> All right, time for some rails. Just do this, you'll never die. Do, 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 do. Eh? You did not hurt me. Come on, game. No cars for like three seconds because they couldn't, they couldn't add more road. Yet cars still roll, roll there because reasons. More unfinished roads. This is the worst wor road work ever. <laughs> Even worse than Montreal. Gotta love how cars just roll on on these tiny roads. Somehow, they don't even look like 4x4s, but somehow they made it there. And now the last game for the evening is gonna take about an hour, because it's boring, it's long, and it's Storm Over the Desert. I think there's nine levels of this, and you move so damn slow. Also, Giant Saddam Hussein. Which gives you an extra life if you kill them, by the way. <sighs> oh my god. It's a good
Good thing I told myself I wouldn't do more than page two because I don't even know if I'll get to the end of this. I don't think even this music can help this game. You can die? I got two kills in one round. Oh my goodness. Excitement. <laughs> Can you believe the excitement of shooting down pink tanks? <laughs> oh, I can't bear... I can't bear the excitement. <laughs> All their soldiers. Oh, hey, level six. Oh, look, it's side-moving tanks. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Yep, holy. I should ask uh, one of my friends that's in the army, hey, have you ever seen a tank move sideways like this? Do your tanks move sideways? <laughs> I think he's actually part of the tank brigade too, so... Damn, it's a two double scenes. Yep. As you know... <laughs> We all learned from the history book that there was two Saddam in the world, right? <laughs> Saddam Hussein the second. Oh my god, level eight. It exists. Uh, like I said, unfortunately there is nine levels in this. destroy 40 things just to, to the next level. Alright, what's the X code for 40? I don't think I did what I was supposed to do. Hmm. What happened? Did you break it? Yes. Oh, shit. Oh, now there's two bullets flying on screen now. Hello. Level 9! Oh, uh, we're almost done. How many for this level? 50. Ah, uh, why? <laughs> I didn't want to say it, man. It's so bad. Reminder that now everything is going at ludicrous speed and I'm still slow as fucking molasses. Like, I was already slower than the enemies at level 1, but now this is just... Absurd. My god, things staying on screen for more than a second. <laughs> Can you believe in miracles? It's a miracle. There is a god. You know when there's gonna be a real god? When this fucking game's over! Can oh, it no. end? Gotta be getting close. Ah, oh, thank Jesus, we're done! Oh, Storm over there in the desert! Fuck off! <sighs> Fuck right off! Storm over I... the desert. Give me a moment, everyone. Yes. Ah! Yeah, this is basically like Fuzz Power's brother. Or something, except he doesn't. He isn't naked like Fuzz Power, so that's good at least. And surprisingly, the controls for jumping are actually better than most uh, Action 52 platformers. On the version. Revision A of this, uh, this game actually crashes if you pass level 1 or if you try to exiting it. But this is Revision B, so. Uh, we can, unfortunately, play this. Alright, level 4. Now we have fake power-ups that are shooting at us. Good. Okay, level 5, I have F lives. Right. You have uh, boss characters or something. Oh, you can't touch the cocoons. Or whatever these things are supposed to be. Level 9! Uh, 
This is fortunately the final level, though. Listen to this awesome music. Because according to game files, this is music. It's disc man. <laughs> yep. Mark two. And level one, we're done with Laser League. That was a long game, this right? Man. I need to figure out how to do the jump. Okay. There we go. Let's continue Billy Bob now. Uh, wait. Is, is, <laughs> did the arrows just disappear? Okay. Sure. There is five stages, but like stages three, four, five will say stage one, but it's actually the next stage. Make the stupid jump. Oh, wait, that arrow's in a bad spot you see over there. Level okay, three. Yeah. Even though it's even though it says stage. Whoa, what? Wait, what? What? Wait, what? 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 Huh? What? What the okay. <laughs> Why is this shit? Or the, and now the Billy Man. <laughs> you know what? Let's, let's let's keep on. Let's keep going. Let's see where this thing leads us. <laughs> No, I feel cheated. What the hell? Oh, well, die at the door. Okay. Okay, for some reason, this brings to Cheetah, man. What the fuck? That's not that. Only... Um, I'm gonna consider this as a soft lock. I guess so. All right, let's just move on, I guess. Cause what, do do? what the hell? Maybe I'll have to revisit uh, revision A. Maybe that glitch isn't there. I don't know. Well, now it's time for shitty spider, man. Oh, this one? Oh. Time to climb to space because we hadn't had enough space game. I don't know how much HP this guy is, but apparently I took him down, so uh, never mind. Nope, just take it as we go. Let's go. Keep going up. Ah, you stupid motherfucker! <laughs> Give her the bits. Uh, I kind of saw it for a second there. What the hell was that? That was a split. <laughs> Thank you for the fits. Try to make solid lines out of the various sizes and shapes as they float down to the bottom of the screen. This isn't Tetris, it's a platformer! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Everyone the fire off the graveyard! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, now the ground is green. We're going oh. into greener pasture. It's greener pastures. Enjoy your stay. <laughs> Beeps and blips, which oh, no, I don't no. even know if you can beat this one. Robots, microscopic, and humongous. Here they come. Ready your weapons and fire. Sure, whatever, whatever, manual. All right, level four. Oh my god, what is all this shit? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Level four is hell. Just try to like try to avoid these things and just shoot. Try to shoot them as you can. I can't believe there's a strategy guide for Action 52. <laughs> Imagine a children's bedtime audiobook featuring Action 52 with Opie's the reader. <laughs> yeah. Oh my you? god. Come here, children. Let me read you a bedtime story. Once upon a time, there were 52 <laughs> city space shooter. <laughs> Okay, these things can't kill me, and I can't kill them. Except if I have an extra hit, apparently. So basically, I uh, it's a game of wait until you get one-ups. Hmm. Good. Oh, they, ca they can't be harmed by your weapon. What the fuck? 
They have the ram into them, but you don't have nothing though. Okay, I think. Maybe we have soft locked? It would help if one up spawn. But they're not because of the freaking thing. No? No, there's. It's an eighth level in this. Manchester! <laughs> Let's start with the thing that everyone knows about Manchester. So yeah, prepare for a lot of that sound now. Alright, time for the description. That's a, uh, you must cr try to keep the rhythm, but noisy little critters won't let you. Roll the drums as they go away temporarily, but they'll be back. Alright, oh, I forgot, this is Manchester, so you can just do this. Don't need to play the level. Oh, okay. <laughs> this works. <laughs> yeah. I'll come to oh. Manchester. Is this his entry to uh, freaking games done quick? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. For all fools, game done quick. Sure. <laughs> Boom shakalaka. <laughs> Can I read the overview of this? This is this guy on the guide. This is finally a game about weed. Why wasn't this the very first title on the cart? He played as a stone struggling musician who, like us, has no idea what he's doing in this game. He's so bait that he hears annoying musical notes every time he jumps. <laughs> Basically, he wanders through the stages paranoid that the other hippies are trying to steal his weed. Occasionally, they band together and project, and project their mental flower power to his way. We can see our character getting further stoned at the, as this game carries on. The first stage starts off quite subtle, with which a red brick and amusing black background. This is probably the character's apartment or something. The next stage, however, is made up of peace signs and crazy swirls. The final Come stage on. is technicolor flowers and sunshine. By this time, our Manchester friend is clearly gone. The whole premise is ironic because the only way you could ever enjoy this game is by being stoned yourself. <laughs> Seriously, it's terrible. Probably one of the worst games on this card. In fact, if you have an extra spliff around, ladder up and give this game a try. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> it's not. It's not. Save your brain cells and play something else. <laughs> That's the overview from this guy. We start in spikes. Good. Oh, nice. No, I think this is just sunshine. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbow. Boss. Boom. That's your jump noise. Boom. Boo. Boo. Alright, the description of this, uh, the toad is the mafia boss who uses salamander hitmen. They're all out to get you. But you can beat them as long as your partner, Spectre, keeps a good eye out for those bad guys. Oh shit, it's the f <laughs> It's Don Toad. The heck is this? Apparently these are the equivalent of the hands dropping bombs. Uh hello? Uh what? Oh no. Go back a bit. Didn't load up. Oh. Because I was shooting, the boss didn't spawn. I'm oh, sorry, game. One. There's Don Toad for one last time. Final showdown! We can do this! We can beat boss! Yay! We're the boss! Dead <laughs> dent. <laughs> Let's use the glitch. If you go here, exactly here, the the uh, homing enemies just despawn. Help the ant protect the ant hill from intruder and protect the queen. Push pebbles to close the hole against intruders, but it's not easy. Yeah, sure, sure. That that's what's happening here. Uh, five stages in this. Oh my god. <laughs> 
Name a slang term for policeman. Dick. Please <laughs> came in just to say that. <laughs> and he just leaves. All right, Ambo or Ambo's adventure. I love that. <laughs> you you start with a single life in this game. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, so there is fall damage. Good to know. At least the jump is not that bad. It's actually not as bad as Uza, uh, unlike what I said earlier. Psychedelic time! Time war tickers! Oh no. Time? Where to jump, you have to be moving first. Again. Yeah. And your hitbox sucks. Hey, stop it. calling me wheels! How dare you! As the ticker continues, you must stop the hour blasters and jump that time warp to stop the Level two. Wow, they can't even... The flickering just, like, makes the freaking enemy next to it invisible. Yeah, pretty much. Alright, this game crashes in Revision A. Unfortunately, it works for us, so... Challenging jigsaw puzzles. Shows you picture and scrambles it, and you must put it back together. Finish one, and you get more and more difficult. <laughs> or a repairman with a nail gun shooting at or tools. This because is, this is what happens in this game. This is... This is Action 52 Home Improvement. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, look, see? <laughs> also, this game has the shortest death noise, too. <laughs> <He's> like, <laughs> this game is shit. So much garbage. I think there's full damage in this, too. There is. Proof of concept. Because apparently that's a hole, even though it doesn't look like it. Tool time? Huh? Oh. Uh? <laughs> this is home improvement for the NES. I will do. So much. Oh, um, that's not how tables work, by the way. Oh, wait, sorry. The end of the table is right here. <laughs> it's the table of the future. Uh, uh oh. I, uh, this guy I, went over the gap. It's perfect. What is this supposed to be? Um, what is, what is the. Oh my god. Is that a saw? I think it's supposed to be, yeah. I love that the enemies can just get stuck in the ground. Level 3! And, um, the table's completely wrecked now. <laughs> <clears throat> like, there's a missing portion here, there's just a random middle part, <laughs> they and they enemies going they through the floors because <laughs> Action 52. They got half of it done. <laughs> the table is the jigsaw. You gotta put it together. Ah, so there's the logic. It's time for the noise. You know which one. <laughs> and also, that, that fighting animation. Yeah! Bruh! Master has given you the test to defeat the Zinzen evil ninja tribes. Prove you are worthy. Defeat the evil tribe while avoiding the Chinese star and other object. What Chinese star is? There's some weird stuff going on in this level. Because there's actually wind effect in progress here. Oh, really? Which is uh, kind of surprising. They actually program stuff. 
Oh god, I made a mistake. And now glitch time! <laughs> and now for... supposedly the boss. Yes, whatever that is, thing is. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, you just stand there just like... Hah, hah. You, have to, you don't have to get close to him. But yeah, once you know, once you hear the noise, you know you're doing damage. It's action 52. That's what happened, and the game is over. Robbie must lead his good robots against his evil brother Brainy. But Brainy has his own robot, then it's not going to be easy. Well, you're only one dude against all the robots, so I don't know where are our robots, but... Maybe you are the robot, I don't know. Robbie Robot is a side scroll that they can certainly do without. The game switches between mindlessly easy and frustrating behind all hell. The challenge, as always, comes from poor level layout, horrible control, and terrible enemy placement. Honestly, unless you're a masochist, avoid this game. You can tell the ideas were running thin by the time this game came along. This sounds like it could have been some great title. Boodoo, like boodoo, Wars. boodoo. But don't kid yourself, this is Action 52 you're playing. You control a robot that looks like an overweight gamer. It makes funny sounds as he walks. Like all of us. It's pretty hard to tell this guy is a robot. It has been hard to figure out why this game was ever ever created in the first place. There are six stages in this damn That's your jump noise, by the way. Boodoo, boodoo, boodoo. And yeah, you actually have to go to the platforms, or else you're not gonna win this. Boodoo, boodoo, boodoo. I'm on now! Oh, thank you for the resub, Aizen. Thank you so much. For three months. Thank you. How dare you start the stream while I was working? Dot. Oh well, at least I made it before the main attraction. God damn it. Alright. Well. This game is also called Action Game Master because that's what it was called before it became the Cheetah Man. But, anyways. I remember from. I don't remember what. I think it was an awful Games Done Quick. There's apparently a level skip in this first level, which I was not aware of. I know it's one of these waterfalls. Ah, oh, there it is. <laughs> and there we go. Level 2. Hi, Saddam. Oh, apparently that was enough. Alright. There we go. Might as well get the level skip again. Ah, oh my god! Get out of the seizure! Ah! Oh, geez. oh my Jesus! Oh, oh! And we're in that level that we ended up in after Billy Bob. Anyways, I took too many hits, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna that die. A, that, that was that was funny though that we ended up in <laughs> Cheetah Man after Billy Billy Bob. I don't know why it happened either. This, that was also, awesome. the jump glitch doesn't work in this level, by the way. <laughs> This is like freaking the Genesis version, like the. Oh! Oops. Oh! Ooh! Ooh. <gasps> ah! Ah! Where even the spaceship cries. This is the only way to beat this boss. Oh, uh, freaking Rocksteady really uh shoot themselves up. Look at him. And the other guy doesn't get a description. I think his name's Apollo. But uh, yeah, this is gonna suck because is it? This is where the game gets really hard because the enemies aren't are super fast, and you can only hit like a pixel. There's people just just attempting to talk to you. It's like stop, stop, save that, yourself, stop. No, ah oh my. Oh, wait, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on here? Hold up. Pause. Why are you full screen now? No! Oh my god. I can't even see who it is. Thank you, whoever it is. That was Zaichun. 
And why is my computer lagging at like three frames a second now? Fuck. Stop it. All right, there's the ravioli from Alfred and the Fedek. All right, I might as well showcase it, even though there's nothing we can do about it. There is a Did secret down here, and, uh... Hi. Level 9. Level 10. Oh, hi. Welcome to hey. game the Game Boy version of Action 52. I did not mean to go back down there. Uh, wait, what? The secret is down here too? But it brings to the same place anyway, so... Once again, I ask you, if you're not doing a rewind or save state run, how the fuck do you beat this? And I know it's possible, because I've seen it at GDQ. Are we done with this? Thank God. All right, level six, which is also level five. Actually, we wanna jump up here, and there he is, in all its uh, <clears throat> glory. This boss is super freaking easy if you can get to him. We're almost done, thank you for the fits. We're almost there. And with no fan for you're thrown back to the tile screen. That's the end of Cheetah Man. Hmm. This is Magician Red. Now, Magician Red is too good for this game. <laughs> And at last, we can actually gong Action 52. Thank you, Aizen, for the bits. Well, it is uh, time to say thank you to everyone once again. Yeah, stupid motherfucker! Yeah. Thank you for the bits be, once again. <laughs> this wouldn't be possible if it weren't for all everybody. Yeah, thank yeah. you for everybody who uh, donated to actually make this... Uh, this happen, and uh, eventually we'll get uh, another incentive, which I already know what it's gonna be. And uh, we'll just have to wait until I actually bring it up. Okay. It's, uh, it's gonna be another bad idea enabler. I can tell you that already. Well, I see like five people that I follow that are streaming the Final Fantasy VII Remake. I'm not surprised. <laughs> Final Fantasy 7, Final Fantasy 7, Final Fantasy 7. Jesus Christ. That's too much. Goodbye, right. everyone.